And I'm so excited. Amazon is using star power to hype the company's big annual shopping event with celebrity performances, launches, and product discounts. You don't need to go shopping anymore. You just go to Amazon Prime. All part of the 48-hour sale, kicking off at midnight on July 15th. Now we have over 1 million deals available on Prime Day. With new ones popping up across categories every five minutes. You have to dig through a lot of stuff to find the handful of gems. Prime Day discounts are exclusive to those with a Prime membership, costing $120 a year. If you don't want to spend the money up front, you can get a trial membership. Then you can always cancel it if you don't want to be a full all-year paying member. Amazon hopes to surpass the $4.2 billion in Prime Day sales it raked in last year. But retail competitors are primed to compete. Target launching its Deal Days sale, touting no membership required. Hey, Google. And Walmart's Google Week offers smart home device deals through July 16th, taking aim at Amazon's voice assistant products, often at their lowest prices on Prime Day. This year when, I mean, if Amazon crashes. eBay is having a crash sale on July 15th, mocking Amazon's technical glitches during Prime Day last year. We certainly know that some customers were disappointed. But Amazon says this year, we're ready. Next Monday and Tuesday will prove if shoppers are too. Liz McLaughlin, NBC News.